I mean, it, it's not another uh, another side. If you know the, 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 the people who were, who were talking about the women's issue earlier, mm -hmm. I mean, if you read the Mary Wollstonecraft book, uh, uh, you, uh, you know about the basically the arguments for the rights of women. I mean, parts of the oppression of women uh, has all been to do, do with the fact that there were men there saying that there's such a thing as human nature, and that human nature is that men are strong, men are organised, men, men are, uh, are, are able, and women are the opposite. Look, the now, point, the what, what's that, different sorry. between that argument and the ones that so you're putting forward about economics? Even if a reasonable minority of people have this state of mind that they want better and more, then it will crush a system where the system is based on, on the fact that people ought to be wanting to share. If the so, system allows it. You know, I mean, it's, if, again, it's just a question of, I think, the, what you, the, the, this ideal situation that you propose is based on the premises that everybody will behave in that way. If there are a few people behave in other way, then the system won't be equilibrated. So even if there's, uh, <coughs> if there's, I don't know, 50% of the people don't want to share their 10 million. They want to invest their 10 million and make 20 million. Okay, so if 50% of the population doesn't want to share the 10 million, the 50 other percent of the population that want to share the 10 million is not going to, is, I mean, he's going to get abused, you know. Even if 20% of the population prefer to get more rather than to share. The 80% is good. Even if 100 people decide <laughs> to make a lot of money instead of sharing, then you have oligarchies, right? If there's even somewhere a, a, a big enough example of people that don't want to share, then the whole system can't work. And therefore, the system based on the idea that people have to share is more wishful thing than something that's actually applicable. But there are solutions which are not based on human nature. They are based on, you know, just... Social contracts. No, no social, no contracts, basically. It's based on um, a reasonable economic um, decision that money can be shared in, in a better way than it is now without taking into account the individual uh, ambition, preferences, uh, nature, etc. of people. It's just based on the money rather than the people's nature, which I think is a more reasonable way to construct a, a system. Can I put, post something in here? here? No, 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 that's cool. I just wanted to... Um, okay, so, so one of the criticisms of capitalism... You, you brought up this interesting scenario where you... A system based on kind of people's good intentions is kind of inherently flawed because actually 50% or small minority, 80% or whatever, some proportion of people are actually going to be really wanting to maximise their own wealth and a small proportion of those are going to be pathological. I think you said that. So so what about the, 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 the one of the criticisms of um, capitalism is that actually what it it, it does is it encourages everybody to the dominant value to be the kind of this you know the, the criticism of the company the co company is like a psychopath but actually it kind of encourages everybody to to kind of maximize that greedy or the worst instincts in us and the psychopath to rise to the top so what in 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 like a, in a kind of a that seems to be a risk as well like so how do you in the kind of a Distributed intelligence, money basing. How do you, how do you kind of bring out the best, the most altruistic? How do you deal with the fact that there's small proportion of no? How do you deal with the fact that how do you bring out the best, make a system that allows for the worst, but also brings out the best, and deals with the kind of the, the psychopathic tendencies, and that make sure that those people don't rise to the top and exploit everybody. I mean, that that is surely a problem. If you, yeah, yeah. You know, there's, uh, I guess, laws have to be voted <laughs> to prevent psychopaths from accessing power. Um, but those laws, I mean, a lot of those laws are already in place. I mean, I don't know how many psycho actual psychopaths are are managing, you know. Well, I mean, here's, you know, here's the, ta here's the tangible... Loads of them. Here's, <laughs> running here's countries. the tangible... <laughs> uh, I don't know, I guess, uh, you know. Here's the tangible situation, right? You know, yeah. why do we buy smartphones when we know they're made by slaves? Or by people, you know, who are working in inhumane conditions. We still do it. 
I suppose well, one of the other part, but I mean, one of the problems there is that there is no, there is, it's very hard to find an alternative. I mean, there's one, there is one on the internet that you can get for, a fair phone. like a fair phone, isn't there? There is a fair phone that you can get, um, but it's really hard actually to get hold of that. That is one of the, that is one of the. You mean it's expensive? Yeah, it's really expensive. Well, <laughs> you know, yeah, that's, and also that's it's the hard price to, of you know. And it's also hard. To, it's also hard to know about it as well, isn't it? Like that's that's yeah. also the price of. Yeah. Marketing. Yes. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. So you know. That's but then I suppose now we do have the fair phone. That's the situation. Then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm just going to mic that down. So and we've got to finish. Yeah, we're going to have to. Yeah, we've only. Yeah. You've to written so much. You've done so <laughs> well. Wow. Okay. Yeah, Fantastic.